What's good guys, Jimmy here when I have a video today. I'm today. i am going to show you guys my tackle bag. So the first thing I got is some pliers right here. Um, Rapala pliers. Got it from basketball shops. And some cheap school scissors right here, alright? I hope you're less hearing me because that video, you already didn't hear me. So, alright. Let's move this pocket right here. Pocket. I keep a flashlight. I'm just trying right now, but uh, keep some power bait or magic bait. Let me get it right over here. Let me try to open it for you guys. Yeah, probably can't open that. And I got some goop right here. My crawl is pretty decent. Bait. Oh, I can open this one right here. I'm gonna get in there. I'll put it down for a second. Sorry. This bitch. Stop cursing. Alright, move to the next pocket. This pocket, I keep my small soft plastics and ice jays and other things like that. First thing, Pepper Pro Lightning Tails. Let me get on focus real quick. There we go. Clungy Crick right here. More like a light green pumpkin or something. Um, aesthetic shit. Oh, oh, there it's at. Let's see. Damn, this is... Android is focusing well over here. It's just like... There. That is Ozark Shack. Got these. Squirt squirts right here. Alright. Um, this is a pearl. Um, blue pearl. Blue pearl. Great baits. Uh, some shrimps right here. Let me try to get them out. Um, I see another that bullet case, but you no. Know, some more, but those are cream. And some pink worms. Quartz tra trailers and some two glitter. These are very good for jigs. Um, uh, blue pearl minnows right here. That's some black pearl ones. Really good, really good stuff. Alright, moving to the biggest of plastics. Uh, I keep my, yeah, some zingers in here, some zoom, some water. It's just not talking like it is. It's crap. Alright. Let me try to take it Yum diggers and watermelon pearl lamb. Let me try to get it right there. Alright. Great bait, great little bait. Some lizards and watermelon chart right there. Yes, please. Alright. Some tubes, like in a coffee color. Yum, tubes. Focus, please. Thank you. Alright. Baby brush hog in black and blue, or you can call it June bug. Alright. Some creature base and watermelon pro lamp. Watermelon uh, pro belly. Right there. Two. Good old creature base. Super salty flukes and albino. You know how you pronounce it. Sub oh. and uh, some more and smoky shad right here. Good on the central grid. Great for spawning bass time. Some pug from shad and just regular shad color. Alright, good for fan fish and stuff. Right here, uh, pug from shad right here um, and trick two shad. Really good bait. Um, Personal best for spawning time. Alright, um, these are just some homemade lures in there. I wish I could see these, but. Uh, I'm, a, I'm actually going to open it, guys, for this. Please wait for a second, please. Alright guys, I'm almost done right now. Please sorry. So sorry for being so slow. Shit that is over. But okay. right there, like a little blade bait type bait. Low hook in them. Yeah. Not trying to stop y'all. Um
10 pound line right here. Really great line. Uh, I love this. Particular. That's a young Crawbugs and Crawdad. The big one this is for Texas on a one hour slot. I got these ones good for trailers. Alright, moving into this box. Um, just a little soft plastic. First, we got some Sankos by Berkeley right here. Good old fashionable Sankos. Got some little shad ones right here. I think these are by Cream. Or something. Uh, some more Berkeley, some more Berkeley, some, some more Berkeley right now. I'm trying to get in there. Let's see. Um, not my. Um, got my nail, my line covered by birth my ring. Do my slow backwards. A tape measure. A little bit too much. Uh, some more shad ones right here. Same brand. Has a smaller one right there. Alright. Moving to the next thing. We got some striking base, two packs of striking sankos, and some super soft two toes. Um, I made this little kit by myself. Oh, no, that's not the best or something. Uh, Wooly Bee. Grog right here. Uh, another char of them. Has to get out and try these guys. So they're absolutely phenomenal bait. And I got some, uh, grub right there. Some more grubs. Some tad tadpoles. Really great, um, this is sponsored by Yum and uh, really good stuff and just an eagle claw swivel size screw up in there, one seventy nine at Bad Pro Shops. Really cheap, really cheap stuff. Alright, moving into my hooks and my weights right here. Really good stuff right here. Um just really bad stuff. Not really classic. Have on catfish box. Half off weight for a river fishing for some small leaves. If I'm gonna go down deep or something like that. Wendy thoughts really good for Carolina rigs. 116 pounds, now we're throwing on with that for. Um, we're right throwing 116, 122, 132, 116, uh, 122, and I know a lot of these things, but whatever, 132, 2 ounce weights, and 1 ounce weights there. Uh, half ounce, 1 fourth ounce, 5 odd, uh, eat them G, gum and gas, blue hooks, and Y, X, Y gap, some jigs, or whatever, pepper shakes, and some chocolate hooks right there. Really good stuff. Um, by the way, this tag box only came with boxes, I don't know why, uh, but whatever. This box is a little bit messy, it's a random blue box. Got my junk fish with lot of jigs, but I have some, I have like one jig, but whatever. Have a black and blue jig with a little minnow on there, flipping jig, got a spinner, got a uh, Z-Man bug bait, and got a spinner right there, got a spinner, pretty fantastic stuff, got some uh, Malibu jigs, some frogs, pretty good stuff, a booyah spinner, and some walleye jigs. Moving to the best box ever, my hard baits. Um, first of all, let's tell y'all guys, uh, I have panfish and bass in here, so enjoy. Square bow. Not non-round addition. No square bow is good for rivers or lakes, whatever. Uh, deep diver and a top water minnow right there. Okay, get it. But both of those are rebel and one on top water. This one is... Top water and that one is deep diver. Little top water jerk bait. Um, crank bait right here for pan fish. Uh, cricket, frog and tiger, and a crawl right there in the natural car type coloration. A spoon for redfish. I use redfish a lot, but got some small little lipless crank baits. So instead of being it so, um, lame. I just put like a hair jig on my boots or whatever. Mackerel, um, yeah, mackerel jerk bait for, um, 
salt water, top water, popper. I think it's my booyah. This is my booyah. Lure that I'm working on, really good lure. Uh, lipless crate. No, he's no. Like rider trap, rider trap, right here. And super spot, and condola right there. Uh, uh, it's a super spot bait, and yeah, that's basically everything in my tack bag. I hope y'all enjoy. Subscribe, comment, like, and see what this is about. Let's go, yeah. Alright, let's subscribe, comment, like, and I'm out.